I'm gonna show you how to do this now. Ow. You're gonna need a Torx 8 screwdriver. I don't want to take this apart because it's kind of pain to put, to put back together because like the sync button isn't on right. It's like it's bulged out sometimes, and if you hit it like just for a second, it like unsyncs it. So what you what do you what you want to do? Just take the controller, unscrew the six screws in here on the back of the controller, then take the battery pack off. There's one right there behind the thing, you know, the warranty sticker. Take that out. And that takes off the warranty of your controller, by the way. So if you don't want to mess up your warranty, I don't recommend doing that. Then, before you take it apart, I recommend taking tape and putting over these buttons so they don't all fall out everywhere. And the menu button, I'm just going to show you like a off-brand con. It, it, it's actually two pieces. It's this clear piece, and then this piece. It goes like that. It's not just one button. I just I figured that out by myself when it fell out, and I didn't know what it was. So you would tape all the buttons to on, pry it apart gently, and um, if you wanted certain colors like mine is, just go on a website or go on eBay or something and just look up. Sh a sh Xbox or 60 controller show, and it would pop up with different things. And you like, you can pick up what color you wanted and stuff. I don't remember where I got my line from. I think it was one was from eBay. One was from, I oh, know, go on Amazon. It's a lot better. I got my, those two for like five bucks each. Nice deal. Now it is like it's not actual brand, so it is a little bit cheaply made, but you know it's worth the money. Um. The triggers I can figure out how to take off. I didn't want to break the circuit board, so if, I'd recommend just leaving those there unless you want to figure that out on YouTube. I took the rumblers out of mine because they annoy me and it makes the control out more lighter and easier to hold. Um, what else? Oh yeah, the D-pad. Um, where's my control? I like my drawers. It's like my control customization place. Drawers, pieces. So, some, no, all of them are like this. No, I lied. Some are like this, and some are like this. It doesn't matter, but you need a small Phillips screwdriver to fit in the holes, and then you would, um, I think you can just like pull it right off. Yep, you can just pull it right off then. Now this one, I think... You have to do something special too. Nope, nope. You just pull them both up right off. Then um, what else did I do? On um, the sink button, that's kind of annoying. Um, <coughs> excuse me. There's a little thing right there. See it? Like a little hole, orange dot. That's kind of hard to do. It's a little annoying. Rocky. I don't know if you can hear my dog, but he is barking like a maniac. Alright, so my new custom control I'm doing. I do want to spray paint this one. Caramel color. The one I'm doing right now. It's going to be like this. Black D-pad. Black triggers. A caramel back to match it. Caramel controller pack. Orange thumbsticks, because uh, for some reason I think orange and caramel go together. And then you know, like black trim and black bumpers. And, you know, grill. I don't know what you call that. And then I got pink LED lights for it. The circa board. It's right here. And I'm going to add... 
you know, it, I'm adding this for multi, not multiplayer. I'm I'm adding this for zombies and campaign. Kind of like a little one mode but mod button right there. That's, that's all I really actually need is a mod button because my pink LED lights are like downstairs. So yeah. Oh, here's my room by the way. If you were wondering. La 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 la. So yeah, um, if you understood what I said and you can actually hear me, because I don't know if you can hear me or not, tell me, please. Um, I personally like my controller, but my friends tell me that they don't. They think it's weird because it's green, and they think green's weird. He said to do it flames. Like, dude, everyone does flames. That's why I'm not gonna do flames. I want to spray paint two colors. Spray paint it all one color, the color that you want it, that, like you want the design to be. See, look, these stripes, they're gonna be black. So I put the tape of the, the that color that you want it. Then spray paint, spray paint the whole other color. So yeah, this is Phoenix Nine, Phoenix Nine.